only time I remember going into something with, an, with a clear agenda of what I was going to do was when I defended the WBC title against BJ Flores. I told Eddie Ian, I didn't want to fight BJ Flores because I thought he was a wanker. But I agreed <laughs> to it anyway because Eddie was out of on it because he was David Hay's best mate. So I said, the only way I'll fight BJ Flores is if you get David Hay to beat me Paul and ringside. And he went, what's David Hay got? I said, just, you just get David Hay ringside. And my plan was always clear. As soon as I became world champion, I just needed to make as much money as fast as possible. Yeah. And David, they had the biggest fucking pound sign on the front of his head. It was like the fella in Red Dwarf with H. David had the, the pound sign <laughs> nailed to his forehead. So I always knew genuinely deep down how I would beat him. Just styles make fights, it's just how boxing works sometimes. But the confidence that you were, that you know, you, you had. Like, I'm running up to it. Yeah, no, but, <laughs> That's but what people say. Why are you your confidence coming from?